We're going to unravel a hard Sudoku puzzle from the New York Times. This puzzle was suggested by a subscriber. John, thank you for suggesting this puzzle. This is a hard puzzle that was in the New York Times on May 26th. It isn't a real tough puzzle, but as John said, it's interesting if you solve it without pencil marks. And it has a tricky spot or two, so we're going to tackle it now. All right, first of all, we're going to put a four right here. And you may wonder, how did you get that four there? Well, we've got a four here. The ghost four is here. So one of these is a four. And if you look right here, we got a one and a nine. We got a nine here, so one of these is a nine. We have ghost ones here, so one of these is a one. And I know these are one nine twins because we have a one and a nine here in this column already. So that's how I got that four. We had four ghost fours. And then the four goes there because we have one nine twins there. All right, the next number is a little bit tricky too. That three goes right there. And we've got a three and a six here. So we have three six twins right there. The, the six goes here or here because we've got a six there. But how did I know the 3 went there and not here or here? Well, we've got a 3 here. So in box 2 here, the 3 has to be here, here, or here. We've got a 3 here. So in the box, uh, the 3 in box 8 has to go in one of these four cells. Using double column elimination, it eliminates these two cells, and 3 goes there. All right, now we're missing two five and seven from this column. We got a five and a seven there, so that's a, a two right there. And now we have a five right here. The way I know that's a five is we're missing one, four, five, and seven in this column. And we've got a one, four, and seven in this row here, so that's a five. All right, that makes that a 5 because there's a 5 there. So we'll put that in. And uh, let's see, we've got... And now we've got a 1 here. There's a loner cell right here. Um, and the 1, we know the 1 fits there. Okay, now that makes four seven twins right here and five six twins right there. All right, and then uh, after we put that one in, we have a T pattern right here. And you can learn about patterns on SudokuPrimer.com. Uh, with that T pattern right here, we've got three. A one, three, and a five. We got a three and a five here already, but we know these are ghost ones because of this T pattern and that one right there. So we got a one here, ghost ones there. So one of these is a one, and with that one, we know that's the one right there. All right, and now there's only five and seven missing in this column because we put the two in up here. With that five there, we can finish those two numbers. All right, now if you remember, we had one nine twins here. We also have four seven twins there, so that means these are five six twins, and I've mentioned all those already. But there's only two, two cells left here that we haven't identified, and those are two eight twins. So we have four seven twins, one nine twins, five six twins, and two eight twins. And then I mentioned three six twins right here. So what's this right here? Two, five, seven. All right. We can't solve any of those yet, but uh, those are two, five, seven triplets. All right. 
Let's see here. Let's look at this row right here. We only have three numbers missing. Six, seven, eight. So six, seven, and eight are missing. We've got a six and a seven here that this cell sees, so that's an eight. And now we're missing six and seven. We got a seven there, so that's a six, and that's a seven. All right, and then we've got a seven here, seven here, seven there, so that's a seven. And uh, with this six we filled in, we can do the three six twins that we knew about. And uh, with the 8, we know that's, we can solve the 2 and 8 twins that we had there. And with the 7, we can solve the 4, 7 twins there. All right, now, there's a 2 here, 2 here, so that's a 2. Four seven there four. Now we've got a four here and a four here, so that's a four. All right, and what do we have right here? We got one, two, four, five. We've got a one there already, so we know these are two, four, and five. So we're missing in these two cells one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9. So we're missing 3 and 8 there. We can solve them because of that 3. Alright, um, let's see. Now we're only missing two numbers in row 9 here, 6 and 9. And we got a 6 right there, so we know that's a 9. And that's a 6. Okay, now we're missing 1, 8, and 9 here. We can put the 1 in because it's the only number missing in this column. And we've got 8, 9 twins there. All right, we've only got one number missing in box 8, and that's a 3. All right, and with that 9 there, we can finish the 1-9 twins that we found very early on in the puzzle. All right, now, um, this, is, this is a bit of a tricky spot right here, but I'll cut to the chase. Let's see what number f numbers can go in this cell right here. Already got a one, so there's a two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So two and five go right there. Two or five. There are the only two numbers that can fit there. Let's look at this cell right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's a 2 or a 5 also. So we have two 5 twins right here. And look at this. Um, remember our 2, 4, 5 triplets right here. This has to be a 2 or a 5 because of that 4. So we have two 5 twins right here in this column. And what are we missing here? 2, 5, and 7. But if that's... If these are two five twins, that can't be a two or a five, so that's got to be a seven. And with that seven, we've got a seven there, seven there, seven, seven, so that's a seven right there. All right, and then with that seven, we've got a nine here, a nine and a nine there, so we know that's a nine. And with that 9, that 9, we've got a 9 there. All right, now we're, what, what are we missing here? 1, 2, and 8. There's a 1 there, so that's got to be the 1. 
We've got two and eight there. There's an eight there, so we can fill those in. All right. Now, remember box three, we have, um, we have uh, two five twins right here. Uh, we still can't solve them. But let's look at this, this a little bit closer. We've got two five twins here. Uh, you've got a four right here and a four right there. So one of these has to be a four. And we've also got ones here and a one there. So these are one four twins right here. So that means we have one four twins here, two five twins here. What, what numbers are we missing? We're only missing three numbers now in this box. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So these are three, six, and eight. There's a six and an eight, so that's a three right there. And then with, these, with this eight here, we can fill in the six and the eight. So we finished those three numbers because of the one four twins and the two five twins there. All right, now let's look at, uh, oh, we've got a, actually got a two right here. So we can fill in the two fives right there. Didn't see that a minute ago, I'm sorry. And with these ghost fours here and that four, that's a four right there. And uh, what do we have here? Two, four, and five. These were two, five twins. That's a five, so that's a two. And that's a five. All right, now let's see what we're missing in column five here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Four, five, and six. This is five, these are five, six twins. There's a five and a six, so that's a four. There's a five there, so that's a six, and that's a five, and that's a six. And now with that four, we can fill in the one four twins there. All right, now let's see. We've got an eight and a nine here missing. There's an eight there, so that's a nine, and that's an eight. Missing one, three, and five here. Three and five, that's a one. Three there, so that's a five, and that's a three. And now we're only missing a two and a five here. One, two, five. So there's a two, so that's a five, and that's a two. And we've solved it. All right, well, uh, this could have been a fairly tricky puzzle, but we found these 1-9 twins pretty pretty quickly. And that helped us find that 4, and that got us off to a good start. And then later on, if you remember, we kind of got to a tricky spot. And we had these 2-5 twins that we identified, and this was a 2-5 tw twin to that one. So that helped us get past by putting a 7 there. Then we put the 7 and the 9 there, and that, that really got us going on that, that part. So, well, thank you for watching, and uh, I'll see you on the next video.